the opportunity for uh, countries to get together and, and to come to a country that uh, has been a leader in, in the global energy transition um, and to learn. Uh, it really creates uh, an environment where we can build momentum uh, to meet our ultimate goal, which is to stay below 1.5 and reach a net zero by 2050. And being in a country that's, uh, of course, is an energy country, uh, and I think uh, some people think, well, because they're an oil producer, therefore, uh, why are we here? Uh, which is, I think, a misconception. They're an energy producer, and, and they're a leader in green energy, and being, being able to for them to lead and use the resources that they have to help the rest of the world transform or transition uh, is so critical. So, uh, I mean, I think just the opportunity to be here and to bring everyone together, uh, because that's, uh, that's what it's all about. It's about partnership. Uh, I think partnership is the key, and, and that's what the UAE has to offer. So. COP28, um, like all conferences, there's so many ways to address climate change whether it's conservation initiatives, saving the forest, saving the oceans, uh, or protecting the forest and protecting our oceans. Uh, but the energy transition is just as critical, if not probably the most critical thing that we can do to help keep below 1.5. So with that experience, uh, I think it's, 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 we're at a, a critical moment where we can really uh, bring uh, the importance of transition to the forefront so that efforts are concentrated in it so that we can actually uh, really move people to change. And uh, for islands, it's critical. Uh, and uh, so just being here and being able to participate and looking at those opportunities for islands. Uh, for islands, we say we're energy hostages right now uh, to fossil fuels and, and giving us that energy uh, independence and so we, it's, it's a win-win. We, we can uh, now be low-cost producers of energy, but at the same time, help save the planet, which is uh, what we all should be working toward. So it's a win-win. I, I, this conference is about everybody winning together. Not only do you want to transition, but you also want to reduce your use of energy. And Mazdar's uh, leadership in that area, I think, is critical because it's, it's a combination of things. You cannot just do one. And so uh, their leadership uh, is critical uh, for, our, for the world to learn and to help us in this transition. So.